Hey guys, the Light Man here. A profile for January 14, and we have Evil Swarm. Now, to be completely honest, this is actually my same exact build from the last regional that I played at. I honestly feel like this is a good starting point for the deck. Now, I know this deck is definitely going to have to change a lot as the meta progresses, but to be honest, you really don't know what to expect, so... You know, honestly, we'll just see how it goes. So, uh, let's just go into it. You have three Caster. You have three Thunderbird. Three Kirkion. Three Mandagora. Three Heliotrope. Two Maxi. And Rabbit. So, with the monsters, you're essentially always going to see this. Um, you could use a Lantern and Katos, I believe is his name. Uh, you get the Tribute each of itself to destroy either a monster or a spell or trap. Um, maybe I could cut the max C's, um, putting in effect veilers, but like I said, it really depends on what the meta looks like. So I at least feel like this is a good starting point. So as of now, max C's in the main, um, veilers definitely in the side. Maybe I'll have to flip those around, so we'll see how things go. Maybe. I won't even need any hand traps, but, you know, that's everyone's dream, though. <laughs> uh, onto the spells, you have 2 Dress, 2 Pandemic, 3 MST, Dark Hole, Book of Moon, and Roto. So, 3 MST definitely needed because you're going to see tankies everywhere. Um, and then, also, hoping for a slower game, there should be a lot of back rows, so why not? Onto the traps, you have 2 Illusion, 2 Chain, 1 Infestation, one emptiness, two force, one compulse, one torrential, one morning, one bottomless. So pretty self-explanatory. I was thinking of cutting this card, but honestly, I like this card against Firefist. I like this card against Kisteller. So we'll see how this actually works. Um, people are definitely just writing off this deck as you know, meh tier two. But to be completely honest, it's going to stay a powerhouse simply because Ophion can search out their spell card. And that alone, you know, free protection, you know, who wouldn't want that? So, you know, that factor alone, I definitely feel like this deck's going to stick around. They're also essentially getting a Relinquished, and they're getting a Black Rose of some sort in the next set. Uh, so, you know, there's even going to be more powerhouse rank for so... That's it for now, guys. Let me know what you guys think of my build, and I'll talk to you later. Peace.